Hello everybody, welcome back to another FTL mod roulette. Um, you can probably tell what we're doing on this one. Yep, FTL Advanced Edition Arsenal by Mr. Easy Money, who I believe I actually have on my Discord servers. That's keen. Um, I have never played this mod before and I was really planning on just sitting on it until it actually got its full release because there's still a few things that didn't get translated yet but I'm hoping to get some help from chat um, when things do tend to pop that so the kind of mods I currently have on is just the uh, Arsenal mod, the limited time offer and the extended pursuit indicator that is all and I'm already digging that slug with his sunglasses on. What was his name again in Futurama? Ah, whatever. The guy who was always partying. Anyway, let's do a new game. Hello. A lot of this stuff seems to be coming from Captain's Edition. Then again, I don't know who did it first. Point Beam. I said they're called Point Beams, not Pixel Beams. Okay. Join the back arm, join the accelerator. I was able to show you an image of any room even in, in the absence of working sensors on the ship. You can scan rooms on your ship. It does not require additional power supply, but at least one other weapon must be active. Yeah, okay. I think there's something wrong. You can probably fix it. But the only mods I have is... Um, check Arsenal English data and English resource pack if there's something wrong now would be the time to tell me though I tell you what um, for people not watching this live, I will see you guys in a small bit. Alright, so apparently there was nothing wrong. Anyway, let's pick a ship then. Um, of course you wouldn't change that. Everybody loves the Vindicator, right? Ooh, this looks different. Fire beam artillery. <laughs> uh, that pierces all shields, deals one system damage per room hit, cutting through crew and possibly starting fires. I like this. All right, <clears throat> and we have a slug with a pair of shades on. I should have looked up what his name was. Eh, yeah, whatever. Let's go. Delving into Arsenal for our very first time. There you carry is vital, blah, 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 nothing new here. Oh, these icons change too. Which is badly damaged, still being sold by Space Pirate. Victim because it's fresh metal until the pirate cuts in off with the bounty if you sit tight. Well, he's got a missile launcher. Ah, attack the pirate. Oh, and he's got one of those too. Okay, cool. Uh, let's try to turn that off. Or not. If this is not the best indicator of any missiles don't miss, yours always do, then I don't know what's going to be. I really should have set you there. Okay, you're going on shields now because that's going to happen soon. Oh, jeez. Okay. C E N O. 
First of all, we're not playing Captain's Edition. Second of all, I'm pretty sure I've got more hours in this game than you do. Alright, uh, beam. Eh. Not bad. What? You surprised that this is not Captain's Edition? great if there was like a little box of text underneath the video that like shows you what mods I'm currently playing. Wouldn't that be a great thing? Uh, if I click this I'm gonna get shot by another missile so... Let's get that bridge fixed while we're here. You're never entirely sure of that sarcasm. Let me just point that out straight away. Well, let's hope we can get to see some new events. You have to just beacon your small asteroid belt and find the ship with pirate markings particularly partially crushed between two large rocks. Are you not able to cut them out with a uh, the fire beam artillery probably isn't considered a beam or is not added to the list of things to do this with. Um destroy and loot. Hey, we got to deal with another missile launcher. Woo! Ah. Alright. What I always wanted for Christmas. Alright, let's see if we can guide him into a room so we don't have to move our crew around. That's a freakishly quick missile launcher. Could you like not do that? Fire beam also, this fire beam also does system damage, so something's up with it though. And yeah, we can, especially if it's a campfire. Chemical fires. Technically, if you use normal fire, anyway, technically, if you use normal fire, you wouldn't even be able to beat up the rocks, would you? Fire is effective against everything, even the ice ships. It's not the most effective, but it works. Slowly. Painstakingly slowly. Well, 
Well, that looks like a pretty big weapon that could probably pierce a shield later or two. Ew. Kinda wish I didn't know that. Piloting next, well, of course. This is getting slightly ridiculous. Hey, you intercepted the shot. Sweet. So all the damage I've done so far has been mostly thanks to the missiles. That is sad, alright? Legitimately sad. We need a new gun. Probably quick. Is there a store? There is. Let's see if it's got a weapon, otherwise we are upgrading shields. It does not have a weapon. Probably not. <sighs> is it really named after that? That would be surprising. Anyway, uh, is there another store? Oh, shows you. Okay. You know, I really don't appreciate it, you harassing my viewers, though. Oh, no, of course there are weapons. Alright, goodbye, FTL navigation. Or the ogre. No, the ogre doesn't even sell for us. My god, people must enjoy this weapon. Allow the ship to jump to any previously visited beacon. That's pretty much all it's saying. So goodbye. We need survivability. Oh, I still don't have enough. Well, take the over as well then. Oy. And then there's another store. My god. Anyone? Something, something black hole, I would reckon. To anyone viewing this after the facts, yes, it's gonna happen quite a few times, I guess. It's a new mod, so I kinda wanna see what I'm doing. Or what I'm getting myself into. It. Probably some air in a black hole, something shooting at you, but you know. We're not playing in infinite space, and I generally try to keep tabs on not getting into dance but yes technically you are correct it's good for those things well i'm gonna wait it out for another minute uh, if nobody's got a decent translation up we'll just move on I can't do anything but it continues, so... I was asking you thought you were bound, were bound in the war, or just a chance to check my honors. <laughs> wow, is this, is this the guy from Avatar? Alright, let's go. Thanks for the translation, by the way. Oh, it's not getting through a shield layer. Ion. Oh, that's an ion pulse. All right, so that just fires. Which means we're doing this.
course we lose weapons. I mean, what did you expect, really? He already gets a shield. Don't take my weapons out again. Oh, he did. <sighs> you know, when the base game basically goes, they'll fudge you. Fudge you and everything surrounding you. Gotta do it. I wanted to do oh look, he lost oxygen now. All right, I'm pretty sure he's terrified now. <sighs> Maybe we'll see how it goes. I mean, honestly, at some point you do gotta realize that the game is just saying fudge you, right? My weapons got taken out twice, he lost his oxygen in his doors, oh no! Well, we're still alive. It's something. I'm not gonna repair though. Slug, uh, you win, we're not cut out for this. Your slug knows what they are going to offer you as a reward. That's cool. Right, let's get a power bar. Man's <coughs> military scout seems to finish up a salvage up on a nearby wreck. If no time to waste with warnings and appear to wish to fight. Might as well get a the experience, right? We're gonna wait longer anyway. Artillery going. Watch your eyes, grant up with warnings. Uh, da -da. Well, it's a good thing I got that uh, other power bar for engines. We would have been screwed otherwise. But hey, surprise that our missile launch. 
Not surely. Okay, go fix. They got a stupid person on. Repair duty anyway. Alright, fire beam artillery, do your thing. Or not, because they got the missile launcher up. Well, it started a fire. Anyway, I'm not gonna wait for uh, the fire beam to finish them off. It would take way too long. That's not guaranteed either with all the possibilities. Let's try to take some damage. There you go. And let's prepare to move on. Cool. Well, we survived Sector 1. It's something, I guess. Well, maybe we won't survive Sector 1, because I can't say no to combat. I would reckon not. If you actually want to do that with a lot of people, we're probably going to have to do that during the weekend somewhere. Good dodges. Good dodges. Well done, well done, well done. Proud of y'all. is blessed by the RNG. That's not us, in case you were wondering. Go for some more weapons, by the way. Welcome, we see the beacon and nothing but binary code. Oh, these NG. You little rascals. <laughs> Alright, uh, with the rebels still far away, you can try to use special features of one of the augments of your ship. Oh. Me? Okay. you think the fire is gonna land into? Oh, yeah, sensors. Did not expect that. Cool. Okay. okay, he's dead, not coming back. Maybe we can get the crew kill here. It's gonna be difficult to do. Come on, come on, come on. Stop running, you boob. 
There we go. Right, we'll wait until the next oil flare is around before we jump. Some interesting looking weapons. Let's say this is just one shot. Go for your shield. Uh, let's go for piloting. Oh, the engine's coming in too. Mm, I was hoping that wasn't gonna be a thing. Yeah, this way it's gonna take a while before we actually get able to do anything here. At least we've got some music to listen to every now and then. Well, you have the option to save to come. I don't. Not that I would make use of it if I did have it. Especially not if I'm recording it. <clears throat> people like to see other people suffer. So that's why I do the things I do. Alright, we've got a store here. Let's check for weapons. We could really go for another one. Yeah, but do you really want me to stop the recording or the stream every five seconds if something doesn't go wonderful? going on, but I didn't know you could do that. Huh. Neat. Didn't even know you could mess with the shield overchargers. Cool. Alright, um... Well, no weapons, which means we repair a tiny, tiny bit. Yeah, no, no. I didn't know you could actually do that. Well, asteroid field should... Yeah, that's smart. <laughs> uh, you dumbasses. thinking as well that it's something that you can't do, but... Seems like you can't. The ship just it's dead. <clears throat> Blew up. No more life signs. What do you mean? I don't know what you missed, though. Alright, uh, we'll go... Store. I, I need more weapons. Auto beam. Uh, it's only one power. Yeah, I, I, I have to. I know it's probably a pixel beam or point beam, whatever they call it, but we are in need of some extra oomph in our firepower department.
Yeah, enemy ships tend to do that when I'm playing. Just randomly catching on fire. Honestly, I got nothing to do with it. Alright, engage the rebel. Hey, look, we got a missile launcher. Who's surprised? Nobody. Alright. I expected as much. <laughs> Oy. Can I hit double rooms? I think pixel beams are the only one I can easily do the exploit with. I'm not a big fan of doing it, but I occasionally want to see if it is a thing I can still do. I need to hit it so that if I turn it like 90 degrees or 180 degrees, the room isn't lit up anymore. I'm not going to spend too much time doing this because it gets annoying really quickly, I know that too. Oop, I had it there. Nope, just the one room. Mm. <sighs> That's fine. Goodbye. Salt laser and like burst laser does increase crew damage. Yes, I want it. It's three shots, of course I will take it. How long does it take to charge anyway? It takes the out it'll take it. Do I get rid of the Yeah. It saved us for a little while, but then something better came along. Not much that can be done at that point. Alright. Freaking roller coaster of equipment we're getting. Okay, let's see here to here, here to here, then there, okay. <laughs> cool backgrounds though. Ooh wow! Nearby NG ship gets in touch. We NG detect fire signatures within our artillery recognition system. Rebooting friend enemy violent of neural communications weapon activated. Oh, okay. Seems that the virus is forcing the NG to attack our ship. Perhaps this has come from the hands of the rebels. be able to get out of here alive. <laughs> Such positive thinking. I know. Okay, so the artillery is about to do its thing, I guess. Wait, since when was there a fire there? I don't know. over there, start fixing that. In the meantime, we will vent the other stuff. And breathe. Thank you. 
Ready for free stuff. Next time's upgrade is 35. Will I get it? Probably so, yes. Although, I could probably invest it in something better. See, the thing is, we got powerful weapons, but they're slow as molasses. So basically, once we do get to fire our first volley, it'll wreck enemy ships, yes. But until that, we're just sucking up hull damage. And that is not good. I've heard the sound for this before. Some kind of weapon pack, I think. I don't know which one it is. Alright, got a pulsar. And yeah, that was Russian. Should have skipped that. Oh well. I just gotta take my weapons offline again, you think? Nope. Hello, Harry. Alright, let's try to get through this. one of those things. Um, somebody's gonna have to fix that. Might as well be you. And my weapons still live. Okay, that's the important bit. Thanks, Firebeam. <laughs> it's good to know you still got my back. Right, turn off everything we don't need. I still got ionized. Oh, because it's just plowed back online. Of course. Timing, right? If there's anything I'm good at, it's getting the worst possible timing ever. It's uncanny, but. It's a thing. It's a thing. Uh, we good now? We good now. Alrighty then. It's a little bit out of the way, but... Um, No ship is jumping away just as you arrive. Send out a quick communication for a jump completes. That ruined bulk is more trouble than it's worth. You see a drifting abandoned vessel nearby. I just quickly pull some scrap off the ship. So the wreckage powers up, still no life signs are detected. You have no idea who's playing the ship, but it's clearly become hostile. Enemy AI. <laughs> Okay. Wow. Good one. Five shots and two hit. But I could have dodged chance like that, but you know. It's apparently a little bit too much task. We'll send you to med base soon. That's better. Here 
going after my crew. Does this thing does more? Yeah, it does separate crew damage. This is actually great to start killing all these jokers with. You know what? You two get to med bay. We'll fix breaches as they come and go. I just want to have both of you above 60 before something terrible happens. Now the ship is actually empty. We get a shield charge booster. Alright. Ship might actually blow. There it goes. Pop. Mm, let's get that weapons upgrade. It's still cheap. Next up, we'll probably get um, cloaking. Firebomb and a heavy laser. I can deal with those. Unfreaking believable every single time. Oh, hey, this isn't destroyed. Now I'll die out. Not a moment sooner, though. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Not sooner. Are you telling me these guys have repair drones on board now too? Okay. Fix the doors while you're there. Go to med... can no longer survive the trip to Medbay now. Congratulations! But it rains, it pours, right? This guy is trapped in there, so he's not going anywhere either. Slug in first. No, two is off, so it's not gonna work. Okay. Alright, so you're kinda close to just straight up dying. Good shots, good shots. And the ship's running too. That's just straight up great, isn't it? Well, at least we won't lose crew. How much bad luck can one guy get? Seriously. And it all started when the doors just couldn't die out. Well, 
Well. At least nobody died, I guess. What would you have done to prevent it? Not get as unlucky as I did? It's better to be lucky than good, but luck runs out. Less bad luck. It's not too much, is it? Okay, we've got another shop coming up. That's cool. Yeah, take missiles. Charge C Y but speed is apparently towards destination. Then. Cool. Well, I highly doubt I'm gonna be able to get cloaking. Cheap, I guess. Time to go. That's not real. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> Ultra unstable. That sounds brilliant. Anyway, before I make my decision on that one, this is going to do it for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you're in the series. Feel free to show support by coming, liking, and or something if you haven't already. We'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.